They say that even a second is an eternity in Formula One, so going four winter months with no racing at all has seemed a very long time indeed. We're back, though, in Melbourne, home of the Australian Grand Prix since 1996. We go racing today then in the state of Victoria where the drivers have 16 corners and 3.3 miles to navigate at an average lap speed of around 120 miles an hour. The close proximity of the barriers makes accidents inevitable and recent history shows us that a safety car is not at all out of the question. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we have got the race of the Formula 1 2016 career mode. First race is Australia. Okay, how was the pull away? You'll have a bit more grip than that on the start, but we need to warm the tyres properly now. Make sure you get some heat into the brakes as well. Okay, so formation lap will have a complete video on it um, sometime soon, so look out for that, subscribe. And yeah, it's it can be hard to get the hang of, but once you got it, it's pretty cool. I haven't yet got fully the hang of it, but you know. I am improving so that did take me actually a couple of tries. This video also there's a lot of skips because the video was like an hour long so I managed to cut it down for 10 minutes so I'll speak to you when the race is starting. Okay then guys we are off for the first race of the F1 2016 season. Nico Rosberg getting a brilliant start there in third place I believe goes up the inside in the first corner of the Haas driven by Roberts as Lewis Hamilton is very close now so he's, he's, I believe that's Kimi Raikkonen as he takes a look, Kimi does but better of it as the two Williams I believe that is fighting with the red ball there ok then we are looking at Lewis Hamilton and Kimi Raikkonen battle not seem to be getting close and Mercedes are very strong they have not been slacking as the Hassan looks to the left, switches to the right, but doesn't decide to go for the move there. Probably better, doesn't want to wreck his car, wreck anything. Can he get the slipstream? Didn't have the best exit off that corner. Doesn't look like he is a Mercedes, he's very strong, especially in the clean air. In the lead, where it is mostly, but anyway, the Hassan. Getting close under braking with the slipstream. Is it only a matter of time? What's going on as he looks round the inside, nearly hits him. Okay, then, there we go again. It doesn't look like they are going to get it. So, this is your order it's Rosberg leading, Robert second in that house, Lewis Hamilton of the Mercedes third, and Kim Ryder of Ferrari fourth. Okay, then, guys, you join us back with the battle for first place. As Roberts and Haas goes up the inside of Nico Rosberg, can he get the move done? He does squeeze them and he is through there. Okay then guys, we are back with Roberts on board now as he locks up, he goes wide. Does he give, does that give up the lead? He is wide, he's on the gravel after that lock up and he has given up lead and second place. Hamilton sneaks through there. Okay then guys, you join us back with the battle for second place. Roberts in the slipstream of Hamilton, goes up the inside with a quick left right hander. A little bit of oversteer, but he has made the move stick, and Hamilton is back there. Roberts in second. Okay, then, guys, this is a battle for first place. Roberts has the DRS in the suit, he goes left of all the places. Go left round the outside. Team Radio says he will be in the pit soon. Makes the move stick, Roberts in first now. Okay, then, Roberts is in the pit. Will he lose a lead? He will. Rosberg, Hamilton, Reichen, everyone goes past. Can this pit stop be clean? We'll soon see. Haas did a good job there, 3.023 seconds, not a bad pit stop, not the fastest, but not bad. Robert exits the pits now in 15th place, and 16th, science goes past. Okay then guys, the Haas is challenging for 14th place on science after that pit stop, goes left, goes right, and then gets the inside move done into that corner, into 14th place as we see him now. Challenging his teammate Gutierrez. Will this be an easy pick? It seems like it. And again, up the inside. Roberts now in 13th place. We are back in the battle now 
for 7th place in the DRS is the Haas Hulkenberg. Hulkenberg has it too because Alonso isn't far up the road there as you can see and goes around the outside. Brilliant little battle there. But the Haas, do Haas does, make it, does make it through there. Okay, then we have another fight. Alonso in that McLaren. McLaren aren't proving to be the strongest for that Honda engine, but Haas does make it through in 6th place. Maybe he can get a run on button now. As you can see, he is. They two do seem pretty fair to each other, but it does like look like the Haas is going to go up the inside. Back as the Haas makes a mistake. The Haas locks up or somewhat there and is off. As the whole field you can hear coming up now as he is trumbling through the gravel at 31 mile an hour. Alonso pass. As you see that, hear that team radio as the real battle now as the two Mercedes go past and the Ferrari of Vettel as Raikkonen in this challenging. As all that dirt on his tyre is struggling to break there, back stepping out just a tad there, but he is in front of Raikkonen, he doesn't get that done. He is in the slipstream, doesn't look like he's going to catch him. We're back once again, the Hassan. After that mistake, is pushed back into eighth place, but. Late move up the inside of Vettel, can he get it done? Vettel seems to go wide, there he does. Now in 7th place the Haas in front of Vettel after that move. Okay then, I, we are back after this little scrap we have. Like the M1 here. But the Haas has a DRS and speed side by side with the Mercedes of Rosberg. And goes past us, looks like the Ferrari of there. Seems following through but doesn't get that move done. Haas now into second. We are back after that first little scrap. We have another one in the DRS zone. Hamilton is getting overtaken by the Haas in the DRS again. As he does get the radio for his pit window opening. Haas does come into the pit. Can it be clean like last time? All the front three cars are gone and Botta flies by. 3.03 start, nearly identical to last time. And that, that is the end of his pit. And um, Hamilton is coming out the pit. He does pass Bottas in the pit and he gets Hamilton as he comes on the exit of the pit. He is now up to P3. Roberts and Haas win the first race of the season. Well, I think the track conditions just really suited their car today. Wind, track temperature, you name it. These cars come alive when the tyres are just at the right temperature. So the more easily you can keep them there, the better your race tends to go. And that's exactly what happened. Their car just looks so comfortable out there. There aren't many teams, you know, as they come out onto the podium now, who could do what Haas have managed to accomplish here. It's hard to believe just how competitive they've already become. An amazing victory. Okay then guys, that is it for the first race of this career mode. The Australian Grand Prix, we did win it. However, I will be up, up in the difficulty for next time. Like I said, in the late last videos, I couldn't do it because you're not allowed to do it in qualifying or race, I don't believe. But yeah, that's really it for this Grand Prix. We do lead the championship and came first with Nico and Lewis coming second and third. Well, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. If you did, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Peace.